Welcome back to another tutorial video and this time we are looking at cultural arts and our topic is what? Introduction to play acting. I don't have a video for you on this one. You just have to pay close attention so that you will answer correctly. Remember your test is forthcoming. On the seventh week is your test so prepare and read harder. So yeah, right here we have our objective, what you need to know after this lesson. By the end of this lesson, you should be able to define play acting and identify some terms used in play acting, some words used in play acting. Meaning of play acting. Play acting means bringing out one's thoughts or imagination for people to see and watch as a play or drama. You watch movies, right? Those things are people's experiences. Stories of people, experiences of people, imaginations of people, dreams of people that they now display, they act to make us see. Because what I'm thinking right now, you don't know. The only way I can let you know is to speak it out or act or display, demonstrate it. So when they are demonstrating things, they are doing what? Acting a play. So it simply means interpreting the character in a drama or play by an actor or actress. So now, now let's look at the terms used in play acting. Number one, we have characters. Say characters. These are those people that are involved in play acting. The men are called the actors and the females the women are called the actresses those people that are involved that act the drama are called characters impersonation number two impersonation this means behaving answering acting and answering the name of another person in a play maybe normally my name is auntie genevieve right and i start acting like a girl called obiageli a village girl that doesn't know how to speak english but really on my own real real i can speak english perfectly fine but just to imitate that girl i start speaking Ibu, and when i want to speak english i speak it so bad that you laugh is what impersonation i'm behaving like someone else now role playing is the same thing as impersonation it's just behaving or acting as another person in a play it means playing the part of another person costume those dresses those clothes one like now a pastor will be given a a pastor will be given a sultan a white long group gown to wear with bible and bell oh he will make his hair like that that's someone that is a celestial priest so they now start behaving like them and Michael is coming holy and gabriel is coming holy and Michael is coming holy that kind of thing they start imitating them you know this those things they wear to look like them are called costume why the last one we have here is what makeup last one we have here is what makeup those materials or substances used on actors and actresses on their faces to improve their natural features those things they will apply on their faces to improve their natural features that will be it on um play acting play this video on and on and on again so that it sinks perfectly in and answer the questions that follows in your class activity section so see you in another tutorial video have a nice day and bye